What is up ladies and gentlemen and welcome to this month edition of the Pro Wrestling Crate Unboxing. This is for the month of May 2024. This is the Tag Team Edition. We are going to be getting I think 8 or 9 different tag teams. I don't remember exactly. They didn't really tell us which tag teams are going to be in this box. They just gave us one which is FTR. If you're new here and don't know what this is, this is basically a Pro Wrestling mystery box what you're gonna find in this box they're gonna be for this one i think they promised us two autographs a by tens two little mini micro brawlers wrestling figures and a whole bunch of other stuff we can find pins uh stickers socks comic books anything else like you can probably think of not really sure but uh anyways also make sure to stick around we're gonna be opening another um, 8x10s that I got from High Spot Auctions, Autograph 8x10s. You're gonna see by who. I'll give you guys the prices and details for that too. So, but anyways, let's get to this unboxing. Also, we're gonna get some t-shirts. Forgot to mention that, which is the main thing for these boxes. Two wrestling t-shirts. All right, got the spoilers on the back. We're gonna go through that at the end of the video. We got our first t-shirt, black t-shirt. We got what I believe is Heart Dynasty or clothes. This is a front and back t-shirt. We got the front right there. And in the back, got the Heart Foundation. Haven't seen on front and back t-shirt ever, I think. At least not since I've been subscribed to these Pro Wrestling Crates, which has been about two years now. All right, we've got our first tag team, the Heart Foundation, second t-shirt. We have... Who is this? FTR, Living Legends. This is our FTR item which means we're not gonna get any FTR micro brawlers or autographs. Next items, ooh, we got some socks. Not really sure who this is. Can't really tell from the outside of the packaging, but let's see. Tag Team Edition, the Nasty Boys. Let me open these up. Nasty boys. Ooh, don't want to rip these. There you guys go. We got some socks. The next item, we have a pin. The Young Bucks. Kind of was expecting them. Oh, well, kind of hoping for the Hardys too. Maybe Dudley's, but we don't really get any Dudley stuff. This is the Young Bucks with the the white suits when they uh, beat up Darby and Sting. Next, we have the Micro Brawlers. Ricky Morton and Robert Gibson from the Rock and Roll Express. No Chase. And this crate, usually if you get a chase, you will see it, a sticker right on the corner that will tell you one out of usually like 500, 300. I'm not sure, but there's the back for that. All right, next item, we have a flag, I believe. This might be the Hardys, maybe? I see the green, neon green letters. Or maybe the X. No, we got the Hardy Boys. Or the Hardys. Matt and Jeff. Flag right here.
they say I want to see the Hardys. Not really a fan of the flags, though. I feel like can't really do much with all these flags. Gonna run out of space quickly. All right. Next, we have a poster. Oh, dang. This is Eddie Guerrero. Oh, and Chavo Guerrero. Wow. The Guerreros. Los Guerreros. On the lowrider. Always nice to get some Eddie stuff. Great artwork, too. They have really been stepping it up with these posters. Look at that smile. All right, and finally, we have our eight by 10 autographs. I believe they did say it was two or maybe just one with two autographs. Let's see, no, it's just one. Who's this? Best friends, Chuck Taylor and Trent. Really cool people. Best of luck to Chuck Taylor. I know he's having surgery or he had surgery. Hopefully we see him soon. I know they said his wrestling career was over, but hopefully it's not the case. I would have really loved to see the best friends win a tag team championship. But best wishes to Chuck. I didn't meet them at StarCast 6. All right, let's go through our spoiler card. We have the Forever Double-Sided Heart Foundation t-shirt. Best in the Universe FTR t-shirt. Ricky Morton Micro Brawler. Robert Gibson Micro Brawler. We're 250 Chase variants for these Micro Brawlers. Then we have the Young Bucks Money Pin with 100 Chase. I'm assuming the chase is with the blood stains on the suits, probably. Usually the chase is a different color, but that's I know their their micro brawlers came out with the white suits and the blood stains all over them. We also have the the last best friends autograph A by ten, the last one of their last signed A by tens. Nasty boy super kick socks, the Hardys three by two flag. Los Guerreros folded poster. All right, that's it for this crate. Not a bad crate. Really love the Los Guerreros, the Hardys, Young Bucks, and the autograph. Nice micro ballers too. All right, as promised, we're gonna go over three A by tens, I believe, or two. I forgot how many I bought, but I bought these from High Spot Auctions. If you watched my last video, my unboxing video, I mentioned high spot auctions, how they go live, they live stream on their Facebook, look them up. They usually give uh, pretty decent prices. And gotta be careful with these, not to bend it. There we go. All right. What's good about these, they um, sent them in uh, top loaders and they kept the prices on these, some of them. First we have a Luchasaurus autograph. There's the price, $15 for this 8x10. And it comes with the certificate of authenticity. So that's nice, usually they come with a JSS or some kind of certificate this is um i don't know if he's signing um kill switch now but this is the old luchasaurus autograph next we have uh gg dolan autograph this one was 20 a by 10 and this one does come with the jsa card I don't know if it has the sticker in the front. Oh yeah, right there too, the authenticity sticker. They all come with a, this top loader. 
And the last one, got a Tory Wilson autograph, also with the JSA. This one, just really glossy. No, yep. But anyways, uh, these are the bonus autographs that I got. This one, I believe, was like $30, $25. They weren't that bad, in my opinion. And they are authenticated, like I say, or some kind of certificate of authenticity. This one right here is the only non-JSA, but still certified. This is by High Spots Auctions. But anyways, guys, um, did I go through the... Next crate, July's crate will feature items from John Moxley, Mick Foley, Penta, and five other amazing wrestlers. This is for the box, the crate for July. They do they did make this every two months now, so we're not gonna have a crate. Well, we might have the AEW crate next month. I'm not sure, but or that might be in July too. I don't remember exactly. Yeah, I think they're both in July. Anyways, guys, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't done so already, and I'll see you guys next time.